what's up guys how's everybody doing today doing pretty good myself thanks for asking uh, I'm doing the unthinkable and I'm not going for a ride today that's right no ride for Mikey son today uh, it's not because the weather's bad it's just I did two routes this afternoon on my bus and by the time I get home it's a little bit like this and I don't feel like heading out right now so I, I'll catch up on my ride another day I'll get in two rides sometime <coughs> but right now I'm going to change my batteries that's right you heard it here first I'm going to change my batteries in that light. That's right. Let's do this. <laughs> Gotta have the music, you know. <clears throat> Alright. There we go. Just popped her open. Fancy schmancy. Oh. So yeah, I noticed yesterday on my ride my back light wasn't doing so good, so. Oh. We'll just change these out. Really all you need. get this light back on so there's one thing done Let's check the front front one's done pretty good hmm and I have one guy that replies a lot. Uh, you'll know who you are. I forget your name. I'm bad with names. We've had plenty of discussions back and forth. But you're always worried uh, about my cell phone on my bikes. Um, but it's been three years and so far no accidents. And I've wiped out and, and all that. But yes, I'm probably the only person you're going to meet that Velcros his phone onto his bike just push it on there real good that's not coming off and I've known people that keep their phones in their pockets be it up here in their back pocket or their whatever pocket and their phones break all the time so um, especially people that leave, uh, that hook their phones onto their handlebars, like up here, uh, prone to breaking with ease. So, if your phone's going to break, it's going to break. And not only that, but this phone only cost me $25. I think that's what it was new, was probably about $25. Um, so even if it does break, it's not a big loss. I'm still searching, uh, doing research and all that on different bikes and what I can 
get this year there's some plenty of options out there but my biggest thing is uh, finding the correct gear ratios and and uh, making sure I get a I personally want a steel chromoly frame they're just stronger and they're said to ride smoother than uh, aluminum or carbon <sighs> but yeah every bike I have is aluminum and I'm really wanting to get a, a chromoly frame so that was it that was my big bicycle maintenance for today changing batteries pretty intense stuff so that's all my little video is today I may do something later I don't know just be on the lookout be on the lookout for new content all the time I hope you find enjoyment from it like I do I hope you get inspiration from it like I do watching other people um, I think I get more inspiration I think I get more inspiration out of watching smaller channels like myself than I do the larger channels because sometimes there's more connection with uh, with one another and uh, and you see people kind of on your same level uh, maybe not just with writing but on um, where they're at with YouTube and maybe their passions with things and different things so yeah always support your smaller channels it's good so all right that's my little humble video today so guys don't forget I do this all for free no monetization no ads that I'm aware of um, I do it for fun hey it's good stuff it's a good good uh, learning good learning uh, thing to do doing uh, videos and editing and doing all that kind of stuff I enjoy it so guys I'm gonna get out of the cold I'm gonna go inside edit this little video and upload it for you to see right now you're gonna see it as, as I'm telling you this you're seeing it so alright get up get out get rad and do it to it good lord even if you're just putting batteries in your light We'll see you guys later. Oh, oh, oh.